investigating the Twin Tunnels of Downingtown, which is a misleading name as there are actually three tunnels. We are standing in the middle one, which is just off of the road, which is completely covered in sand. Um, the one to our left is um, the creek goes through it, and the one to our right is a road. Um, there are many stories about these tunnels um, that would give reason as to why they're haunted. In the main tunnel, there's an air shaft that leads up, and rumor has it that a woman way back in the day um, had a child due to an affair. So she got driven out of town, and in her own grief, she took her baby and stood on top of the air shaft and hanged herself. Um, and legend says that you can hear the baby crying or you can see the woman's apparition. Another legend says that a man came into this tunnel um, and hung himself from a wire. Um, if you drive your car through the middle tunnel and you stop it and roll down the windows, you can hear footsteps or sometimes the snap of a wire. And then the thing that even you disbelievers might believe is there was a gruesome murder that happened here that I'm definitely not going to go into detail for, for a school project, but it was pretty gruesome and they didn't identify who was murdered. Also, supposedly there were satanic rituals in this tunnel. My camera's not focusing. Yeah, my camera wasn't focusing. Any, yeah, so our cameras aren't focusing. It's getting kind of hazy. Well, it's because we're going into the middle of the morning. Can we walk through the tunnel? Right here, either Kylie or Kaylin says to get back, but if you listen closely, there's something whispering underneath their voices. To get back. To get back. To get back. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that is terrifying. In the dark, it was terrifying. That is terrifying. What does it say? I'm at 10%. That is quick. What was it at the last time before we were in the tunnel? Uh, I'm pretty sure it was like 25. Oh, that's not that much. <laughs> For an X, that's bad. Oh. <laughs> Spirits, if you are here, does this sound like Shakira? <laughs> don't do that. If you ask a spirit, don't do questions, they get mad. Do you want to ask a question? No. Because I'm stupid. <laughs> If anybody's here with us today, please give us a sign. Okay. <laughs> oh, there's, what, what? there's clams? There's clams? Like, what the heck? Oh, there are! Shine that in. Clams. Clams. <laughs> right now, we are walking through the main tunnel now. That light right there is the air shaft. Oh, that's what it is? Get out of here. Yeah, Abby's right in the road. <laughs> well, the person coming around the corner has to see us. Okay, so this is the shaft okay. that the woman hung herself from. Yeah. So if we listen, we might hear a baby crying. But all I hear are cars. <laughs> so this is our ghost kit. We have a couple of little useful tools, a flashlight, which we stupidly didn't bring with us into the one tunnel. Um, this one we're not going to use. It's a um, vibration alarm. So if it senses any type of vibration caused by movement, it makes the sound louder than that and longer. We're not gonna use it because it is a road and a ground, <laughs> so it's gonna be vibrating, so no. <laughs> this is the ghost meter. That's what it does when it senses um, electromagnetic interferences, <laughs> um, but it also, um, if you put it near anything electrical, it goes off, so we'll try to demuck that, but ghosts also give off that same interference. This is a thermometer. 
We're all used to this in 2020. I don't have to explain. <laughs> this is the best one. This is the spirit box. Um, if you turn it on, you probably can't hear that right now. No, um, but we hook in the speaker and it goes through different radio frequencies and the ghosts, they can communicate through that. They kind of speak into it. And then our last one, a basic recorder. Um, you can catch the ghosts talking. Um, we call that EVPs. That is the ghost hunting kit. Before investigating, we decided to take a quick dinner break. <laughs> Ready to go, son. As a We're going in. Right now we're just walking through. It's completely dark. Um, Yo, it's not yeah. And there are cars, so we're being careful. We have vests on, as you might have seen. No, like I swear to God, I thought I saw something like move across. Okay, I was just gonna say we need to do a check and make sure there's no actual people yeah, in here. Wait, I, yeah. Okay, right now we have the spirit box going. <laughs> Jesus. If there's any spirits here, feel free to talk into this object that I have in my hands. I hear this place is riddled in tragedy. Would you like to talk about your experiences? Do you remember? <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> yeah, it sounds like it. Like a shh. Oh no, I heard talking. Um, I heard something. I heard a It was like a deep voice, but I don't know what it said. I hear there's a woman here. I heard that they drove you and your baby out of town. How do you feel about that? We are not here to hurt you or disturb in any way. We would just like to know your side of the story. Did you hear like a footstep, like a solid thud, like not like a one of the water drops. It was like a. Did you hear something? Just look at this, the way the water fell, and see what that looks like to you. Right here. Oh, <laughs> oh. oh, okay. That looks like a 
person. Yeah. <gasps> <Stop>. <laughs> the, oh. This is the way the water felt. That's not paint it on. That's... That's water. <laughs> that's weird. You heard that. No. That was a footstep. That was not water. That was a, that was that. While we were recording, a man drove by and decided to stop and talk to us. I kept his face off screen for privacy reasons. Are you guys just like looking at it? At the, at the tunnels? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Wait, yeah. do you live around here? Yeah. Okay, so you, do you know of, uh, we're filming a project for school. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah. we have like ghost equipment and stuff like that. So. Yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah. Okay, I wish you guys like. Have you ever heard of Emeryville? Yeah. Yes. Oh man, they're well, they're tearing it down right I now. I know. Yeah, uh -huh. my dad works right next to there. Where I was not happy about it. You can still get there. I know we can. Um, uh, uh, the train, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Um, uh, what have you guys like seen anything with the ghost? Not here, really. No. no. Did you yeah. go in the tunnels over there in the water? Yeah. 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 How yeah. scary! It's pretty sketchy, right? It is. It's yeah. pretty sketchy. <laughs> Wait, where do you guys go to school? Um, Oct about like almost an hour away. Oh, where at? Uh, Octorera. Oh, okay, high school? Yeah. Oh, word? I was gonna say I didn't know if you were gonna say college or not. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, yeah, but I heard there's stories like the, you guys heard like the lady hanging. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. Are so you yeah. not getting anything in your ghost stuff up? Not yeah, really. Not uh -uh. really. I mean, we can always try again. Yeah. <laughs> Basically, the rumors and the stories, we haven't found any hard evidence yet. I mean, we'll go back and edit and see if we hear anything that we couldn't detect now. But as of now, we haven't found anything. It was a good trip, though. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you for joining us. Yeah, I miss my super girls. Super senior. <laughs> I, miss my, I miss my supernatural girls. All right. Signing off. After reviewing, we found a bit more evidence. But we still concluded most things could be debunked. Footsteps, and as we saw, shadows could be results of the water falling from the ceiling. And the passing cars could explain some sounds. But we'll never know.